Hey guys, Video Plays Games here. Come back with you with another video. Now, this is not going to be a Minecraft video, which I know is depressing. Uh, I love Minecraft too. But I just figured out the best OBS settings for my computer, anyways, because I know last OBS um, video was very laggy. I'm going to say, well, it looks laggy, but it only lagged because I dropped frames on OBS itself. So. I'm going to show you what the best settings are for a, I'm not going to say a slower computer, but not as well off computer, because right now you could tell I have a laptop by the battery, um, and it's not the best laptop, um, I paid 1100 for it, um, but it was, it was very expensive because $200 of it was one, the touch screen part of it. Two, it came with Microsoft Office, so that put basically hardware and the laptop itself was like $900, but it didn't have a, a video card in it, so that's why anything that requires gaming uh, is not the best, so I had to minimize some settings. Now, this is for OBS 0.11.2, which I'll say it again since I had a beep. Oh, this... Uh, video is mainly for OBS 0.11.2. Now there is a they did release an update today, which is over here. I have to install it um, for OBS 11.3. But I figured I would make a video on this first. So first you have general, which your language. I'm I speak English, so I'm gonna keep English. And then there's two themes: the dark, which I like, or default. Default just makes it white. I just like the dark. It looks better. Um, and then streaming. I don't do any streaming, but um, if you do do streaming, you're going to keep streaming services. Then over here, um, if you stream to Twitch, you click Twitch, YouTube. There's also Hitbox, Live Coding, Daily Motion, Gaming Live, Beam, uh, Connect Casting, and Instagib, which most people are usually on Twitch or YouTube. And then um, you choose your server, which obviously the closest one towards me, because I do live in America. I live in New York, so the closest one to me would be San Francisco, California. Um, once you work, once you get some type of code from uh, Twitch, it'll give you a little uh, stream key, which I haven't streamed yet, so there's no point for me to have a key. So next is output. Um, basically... Um, you have to put uh, this in advanced to the top. You can see it's advanced, not simple. So if you guys could do that, just put in advanced. Um, this is the streaming settings. I haven't really touched anything here, so um, don't worry about it. Mostly go to recording. Recording. This is recording. So I have my file output, uh, users, my C drive. Users, Vimy, slash video, slash YouTube videos, which is the folder all my videos go to, which I'll show you. I have this one video, which needs to get deleted, because it's a test. Uh, not going to delete it just yet. Um, I, w I would like to show you guys my recycling bin. This is my recycling bin. These are all of my videos that I've done today. Or in the past few days. Just trying to work with OBS. These are all trial and fails. Most of them anyways. Alright, so back to OBS. I don't get why I won't let me edit this. So, hold up, let me cancel. Go back. Output. Oh, recording. Well, anyways. You would uh, have your type. There's your type. I have mine just standard. Uh, my file output, which is, it says recording path, but it's really where your file goes to. Um, you want to make sure that your recording format is a .mp4. A .mp4. Um, basically, that's what most people upload to YouTube is a .mp4. A uh, .mp3 is only audio. So if there is a .mp3, do not choose that. Choose .mp4. Um... Audio track, I haven't done anything with that. I don't implement more than one audio track into my videos right now. Encoder, choose Encoder X264. 
Nothing else. Alright, and then it's going to say uh, rescale output. Okay, um, you don't want to click that. Um, basically, that's your screen size. So if I go over here, you can find your screen size by if you right click your desktop, display settings. I believe it's display settings, is it? No, it's not. Not display settings. What am I trying to tell you guys? Alright, personalized. It's not personalized. Play settings. Well, anyways, you can right click on here and it'll tell you your screen. But this is my screen size uh, 1366 times uh, 768. Uh, my bit rate, I keep it at a 2000. Basically, the higher the bit rate, the more megabytes the video will be. So just remember that if you don't have such great internet, do not put this up to like a 10,000 bit rate. Um, I don't bother with use custom buffer size. Not yet anyways. Um, do not click CBR. Um, you want your CRF to be 20. If you have a slower or not as good as computer, uh, not the best computer, put that up to a 20. And then it says CPU usage present higher equals less CPU. So basically, um, the default settings are very fast, which, um, that's basically, if you drop it to ultra fast, um, the resolution is going to look complete shit. Um, so, default is very fast. You could probably get away by putting super fast if your computer is really not that great. Um, but I think I might drop mine to super fast right after this video, I'm not sure. But I'll do, I'll do another test run after the, here before I do a Minecraft video. Um, profile, I keep mine at main. I don't think that does much. Tune, I'm not very sure. Uh, I've never seen any tutorials with this, so nobody really touches that. Variable frame rate, um, you don't really want a variable frame rate. You want the same frame rate as you have. Um, don't bother with this X264. It's nothing great. Uh, just stick with what I just tell you. And then basically start recording videos or well, test videos. Not do don't do a full twenty minute Minecraft video or something or sit down and record for two hours and you just see yourself skipping across the map and you're recording because your frames keep on. Um, video. Oh yeah. That's the reason why I can't um edit these guys. Like I can't click these. Because I am obviously running live on OBS. That's so weird. Anyways, I'm obviously running live on OBS. You can see. Um. So that's why I can't edit these. Um. Basically, the renderer. Stick with Direct 3D 11. That's the best thing I've ever. Uh, the other one, uh, I couldn't get it to record uh, Minecraft. So I'm just gonna stick with this one. A uh, video adapter, it's basically your graphics card or video card, whatever you want to call it. Basically, that's what it is. I don't have one in this computer, which is probably why um, I can't really play that many good games on here besides like Minecraft and Unturned and like a few like online free games. You can play F uh, Team Fortress 2. All right. So base resolution is what you want your top resolution to be. Um, so basically... Well, like, you want it to record the full size of your monitor. And then scale the resolution. So basically, it will record, I believe it will record in 720. And it will not downscale to anything lower than 720. Uh, downscale filter. Um, this is for, like, the faster, or, uh, like, this will affect, um, this will be affected by the type of computer you have. I try to keep it on the linear. The fastest but blurry of scaling so it doesn't really make the like it doesn't like do a lot but it doesn't affect your video completely like it doesn't make the the quality shit um you could ch get you could change it but your frames per second value uh like integer wise by clicking on here like right where my mouse is and hitting integer and 30 FPS seemed like a little much for me, so I dropped it down to 24. Um, I might, that's what I was talking about, I might um, 
put this to, instead of it being super, very fast, putting it to super fast. Um, so, um, I could put this up to 30 frames for Minecraft. Um, hotkeys, I like to use, because, because I mostly just play Minecraft right now for YouTube, to record. Um, I use recording F12 to start, then F12 to stop. Because Minecraft really, I don't, I don't think Minecraft uses F12 for anything. Like basic vanilla Minecraft doesn't use F12 for anything. Um. So. Whatever you do, do not use F11 because F11 will uh, minimize and maximize your Minecraft screen. So do not do that. Uh, F3 will bring up like your coordinates, your F, your frames, so all your computer information. So you probably wouldn't want that. And uh, F1 would uh, like uh, make your HUD disappear, and uh, F2 would take a screenshot. So stick with any of like I just say stick with F12. It's probably the easiest. You could also do that for streaming, but since I don't stream, I don't need it. Uh, you could switch to scenes, which um, I have one scene. Um, so. I don't, you could also have a push to talk or push to mute. I don't bother with those because, again, I uh, record in my basement where nobody really talks to me while I'm down here. Or if I get talked to, I just end up making a different, uh, the new video. And advanced, I don't, haven't touched this. I haven't touched any of this, so I'm not sure about it. But basically, say like your videos are really lagging, the main things you got to focus on is to make sure that you have your CRF to 20, or you could go, I think you could, can't go any more than 20, right? Let's see. Well, I believe 22 is like the max, but I just keep mine at 20. Um, and if you're still logging, lagging, sorry, I can't talk today. Um, have this. This, remember, the default is very fast. You have two other sections. I've tried to alt it ultra fast in Minecraft, and it's just so blurry. Like, I know that Minecrafts are blocked. Like, it's all about blocks. But, like, you can't even find what block is blocked in the recording with the ultra fast. It's that bad. So, um, so that's basically all you got to worry about. If you're lagging a lot, change your CRF. Change your frames per second. Um, your bitrate depends on your internet, like how good your internet is, because the more, the higher bitrate you have, the higher, the more megabytes the file will be, which will take longer to upload. Um, uh, you want to make sure that you have the base resolution and the scale resolution, the downscale filter, and your FPS value. So remember, if you have learned something today, please, um, rate comment subscribe um my email will be in the subscription if you have any more questions i'll help you but um i'm not the best about obs but i just know what helped my computer so please um if you enjoyed this video learn something new rate comment subscribe and i'll see you in the next video